Hello, this is not a spring chicken. It's our countdown to Christmas. There's only, well, actually, three days. The, three days? Four days? Three Today's shopping. the 21st. Three shopping days. That's right. Wow, it's <clears> almost <throat> here. And meanwhile, as you can expect, oh, well, should the Republicans go home with their head between their legs? <laughs> the Republicans screwed up massively. They said they had a huge victory, didn't take the victory, <clears throat> and now they're going to make Obama look like the hero. As he's, he has personally contacted Harry Reid to try to make a deal to save everything. Oh yes, we've got old cameras and um, OF added his video uh, comments on the headlines on today. So Christmas is getting closer because she missed the day. I did. Yeah. And there's four dead of dozens missing after the Russian oil platform cameras. Okay, they have more problems with the Russians than they ever did in the United States. There's not one member of the Democratic Party making a statement about the fact that the worst bills in the history of the universe are coming from Russia. Oh, really? And nobody's saying anything. No, I mean, they got an oil spill on land that basically it was at 4 million gallons a day. It's pumping out onto the, onto the Ural, so. And TV companies have a year to pipe down loud ads. I know, we've talked about that before, which basically they're all laughing about it because they're, just gonna, they're not going to pipe down anything. They're just going to raise the volume you know, uh, up and then it, <laughs> it's, it's, it's the same difference. Before they were taking the volume down to, uh, and then the sound would come in normal. Now they're just going to raise the volume up at the end of the, before they go into the commercial and they're still going to get the same peak coming right in the commercial. Train hopping couple buried alive under coal I know. Uh, they, they didn't realize that um, that the, the, the coal bins were being emptied as they were jumping over to them. So that's a good way to get killed. What were they doing train hopping? Um, getting a free ride, hobos and stuff. Oh, really? Yeah, they didn't do a quite good job. You don't hop the train when it's in the coal yard. You hop the train when it's leaving the coal yard. Well, I'd say they remember that for next time. But well, they won't, but they're dead, so. Yeah. Daughters of New Jersey man who fled wife's murder scene found. Well, because, like I said, people don't kill kids. I mean, this is the second. Okay, this is like the third set of kids that have been left after a murder in the last three days now. But crime is going down in our country. Well, this one, shoplifters robbed while stealing from grocery store. No, no, and I like one, too. I like, no, that, that's, that, that, that's, the shoplifters were robbed? I know. Well, because of the, the it's it, it, just somebody figured they were an easy mark, and then you're stupid enough to go talk to the police department by being robbed, and they open. You got a coat that's filled full of merchandise, so. <laughs> Unharmed baby found with two dead parents in Alaska village. Yeah, okay, that's it. That's that news seems to be yeah. I didn't notice that news. No, but this is good. Yeah, so <laughs> I'm kind of looking at the news, basically. <laughs> they're, they're, okay, I, I tend to remember this stuff. It's the same news. Uh, uh, what happens is they recycle news. Oh, it's slow news day. It's a slow news day, so they're recycling some. They're putting, they're plugging in old news with new news, because actually if you look carefully on some, on some of the, some of the new major news sites, they got news from a week ago that are up there. You know, that always surprises me. There's just not enough news that they consider newsworthy anymore, so they're, they're recycling the same thing. They're looking at every other one seems to be recycled news. And fans tell unconventional stories. Oh, we didn't see that one yesterday. Right. ESPN football analyst from the U.S. and the Senate. That was Republican. yesterday, too. And the two Muslim kids that yesterday. kicked off. Yeah. Um, California teenager sentenced for killing a gay student. See, now we got some new news. <laughs> oh, yeah. I know. But, but, well, I mean, I actually pay attention to our news. But since it's all rip and read, you basically don't. But no, he got, um, well, you, you get, you, first of all, why is the reason to keep pointing out that he was a guy killed somebody? It doesn't make any difference if you're gay or whatever. He killed somebody. It's a murder rap. And Sarah Palin says it's not too late to enter the GOP race. Well, that's what they're all talking about now is the fact that um, the that, that thing is so scrambled up now. The party is asking, the party is, oh, is the party asking? No, the party is begging people to stop with the negative ads because what's happening is 
they're shooting Ron Paul up on the list, and Ron Paul will go into the Republican convention with enough delegates to cause uh, you know a runoff in the election, and uh, so you got you end up with somebody outside. I mean, right now uh, the limit. Uh, see uh, what uh, what is it? Ex-Governor Johnson of New Mexico is now going to head the, he, they're all splitting off to the top. They think that the Republicans are going to lose 21% of their support to the, um, to the independent and the libertarian side. So they said it's virtually impossible. They are admitting it is mathematically impossible to beat the President of the United States now unless the Republicans get a candidate that is not any of the above that are currently running. Are you serious? I know, isn't that something? Yeah. And three people dead and shooting at Southern California office. I know. Somebody didn't like them. It's, it's Christmas. And there, I will guarantee you there is no crime in our country anymore. Since Obama became president, crime has fell to record lows. Oh, really? That's what the Obama administration put out yesterday. Oh, well, then it must be true. Yeah. The rapper Slim Duncan shot to death in Atlanta Music Studio. And they're trying to figure out what's going on there because they did have a lot of security around. Somebody walked right by security and killed a Are rapper. Are serious? Yeah. Rappers traditionally have quite a bit of security around well, them. Yeah, because rappers, uh, the gangster rappers are, you know, basically they they have a big problem all the time. People yeah. tend to take them seriously. I mean, it's just like you get a reputation as a tough guy in the film business, people try to, you know, I mean, like Robert Mitchum once got into a bar fight because a oh, guy really? on the river of no return, they wanted to see if he was as tough as, a logger wanted to see if he was tough as what he is. Are you serious? And they ended up tearing up the bar proving that Mitchum was as tough as what he looked on screen, so. Oh, and Grand Canyon officials plan to ban plastic water bottles. Yeah, and they won't let you carry glass in, which means they're not going to be allowed to carry water into the Grand Canyon anymore because glass can break. The plastic, what happens is that they've been, they've been leaving the plastic water bottles behind. That's what happens. So soon, I mean, basically what it means is they're getting ready to shut the Grand Canyon off to anybody with the Sierra Club who carries canteens and stuff. So. Yeah, it's got to be a metal canteen. Well, because they're too expensive. Yeah, you would. Florida congressman draws ire from Nazi Well, he, he just simply said that the the the. Obama administration and the Democratic Party are restricting speech in this nation to the point that it's beginning to look like the, it's World War II all over again and the Nazis are setting out their, making certain only their propaganda was... Are you all, serious? Yeah. And uh, John Huntsman's aide calls Ron Paul's budget plan ludicrous. Well, it is ludicrous. The guy's going to cut a trillion dollars out of the budget the first day. Most of it he's going he's to get $600 billion from the military. Oh, really? And then uh, all these other things. So he's been one swerp at a pin. They said, first of all, the president can't do it. Since the president has no authority to cut the budget, you can't on the first day. The same thing, all of their, they all laugh at all the Republicans. We're going to do this. You can't do anything. A presidential order only has effect on things that deal with the federal government. And if you're, if you're a small business, you know, it doesn't affect you whatsoever. Because of the fact he he busted the family business and everything, basically. Oh, he did. The business would have been destroyed if he had done that. You know, it's, but you know, they said the worst that would happen when he dies is they have to they lose 50 percent. But he gave he was going to liquidate his company and give all the money to the Cornell University, I think. So. Oh, which is why they said he was senile. Yeah. And barefoot bandit gets more than seven years for crime space. Well, that's the guy who was stealing all the airplanes. Oh, is that what the crime space and is? Most of what happened is they give him the, you know, they, because what he would do, he'd steal the planes and they'd crash him because he couldn't fly. Well, so, do you think he'd learn how to fly sometime? Well, nobody would teach him. That's obviously why no one would teach him to fly, because they cra <laughs> he was no good at the so controls. He's still there, like, to go. <laughs> Maybe you should play more video games. Yep. And heirs may take Syria peace plan to the United Nations. That's, that's uh, okay. That's never going to happen because the Arabs run the United Nations, and 
um, and basically the two powers in the Arab world are Iran and Syria. So the Syrians don't take anything anybody is saying. Because, well, because the Syria is a Syria is a, a port country with military might. So when you have a strong military, you need their ports. You aren't going to cause too much problems. Yeah. Well, the correctness never works, and more often than not, it's those that you're so correct about that lead the charge away from it.